Holocaust. Dive across, climb up, boom. Well, not really, not really done yet. Jump across. Neo. Well, there we go, we've done that. That's a constraint. These Dive are down, optional objectives that are synchronization rate. Climb right, over this. Follow the on screen instructions and fill the two Templars. A constraint. Boom. All you have to do here is jump the gap. And that's how it you do it. Your possible jump. That jump is a possible by the way. So well, I think it is anyway. I've never reached it. I've tried to try this a million times and I've never reached it once. Climb up there, swing, climb up this house. Run along. Chimney jump. Synchronization levels look good now. Well, you should be oh, able to hope build you the world. Time to find out what the temple wants from you. And this is Mr. Haytham Kenway. I've had the box, so I actually know sir. a bit of it. The so-called backstory. Right, yes, fine. I'm just preoccupied, that's all. Don't forget your invitation. Master Birch will be meeting you inside. Thank you. Where shall I retrieve you once you're done? Front of the Opera House. And be quick about it. Don't expect to be here long. I'll bring her round at once. I hope you will do, bro. <laughs> Just random person. B. Robot. Not why it's B. Shall I take your coat? Who's getting confused for some reason? Everything's a B. Nah, I'm fine. Ladies and gentlemen, you are requested to kindly find your seat. I'm going to find my seats. You tell me what to do, hey? Okay? Good evening, no? sir. No? Good. This way, please. Oh, my apologies. Here we go. This was like actual theatres. You just pulled like pushing bus about a thousand people you if you're late. Reginald? Really nice. I can't tell you how happy I was to hear they'd mounted this revival. Gay's best by far. Have you seen it before? Once. My father brought me here as a child. Though I remember little of it. I don't suppose tonight will afford me the luxury of a proper viewing either. No, I'm afraid it won't. On to business then. Do you see him? Evil vision, bro. You and the there's a woman in there. Is that a child or so or not? And this is where the parkour comes into the foreplay. Not knowing it comes into play. A thousand pounds. Oh, my apologies. A thousand pardons. Just push him down. Nope, you're not getting up, bro. And then what is it? I don't need a ladder. I mean, it's not like I aim for the ladder. Not very much. Climbing along. Boo boom. Hey, you. I can't even jump up to him and just say hi. Get a room. Oh, wait, you are in a room. 
Do do do. Didn't say anything. What's she doing? Um, okay. Not here. I was not here. Okay. Move along. Hi, people. How you doing? Hi. Ha. Surely, look at all these people here. One of them is going to see a guy w wandering around. Now time for the best thing I could. Well, the only thing I can do good in this game. Basically, just holding positions on the pad, and then well, it's finding and then holding them. So it's quite simple, really. You know? <laughs> Easier than most things. <laughs> you, you've got better stage for. If I use a ladder at a time, when does I aim for a ladder? <laughs> Jump over. Is a marvelous. Ha! Alright, if I could do a jump that goes back. A nice jump. The woman's disappeared anyway. You should have come to me. You would have found another way. Yes. But then you would have known. There's a kid at the behind you. Oh, what it's worth. Pad. I'm sorry. As am I. Don't stab him, don't hate him, don't. Sorry, I've got to. The kid. The kid. Get the kid. No, don't. That's just a terrifying face, Hazel. A kid would scream if, if I would scream if he made that face to me. I would scream. That's just. That scream just doesn't make anything. Makes him look perverted, basically. It makes him look like a villain. It makes him look like a villain. <coughs> it's, not, it's not a villain. It's not a villain. Not a villain. Move. Gotta find a way out. Right so find me. This is time when I want to throw someone down there. Order. Look. I'm just pushing me away. If anyone tries to run in, they get taken out. Like this guy. Yeah. Don't want to be in this time. Someone thinks you're a murderer. You get thrown against the wall and searched. I won't let you go until you're calm. I'm calm. Perfectly calm. Oh my god, someone died. There we go. I'm calm. And how was the old Rather dull. Enjoy the place, place, sire. Yes, sir. 
shall we be off then? Aye. To Fleet and Bride. By your command. To Fleet and Bride. By your command, sire. So much as sire end of it. And that would make the perfect British Gentlemen, stereotype. I hold in my hand Yes, I said it. The this perfect be believed, British it will open stereotype. The doors of a storehouse built by those who came before. Ah, yes. Those who ruled, reigned, and vanished from the world. Do we know what it is that will be held within? It could contain certain knowledge. Perhaps a weapon, or something as yet unknown, unfathomable in its construction and purpose. It could be any of these things, or none of them. They are still an enigma, these precursors. But of one thing I am certain. Whatever waits behind those doors shall prove a great boon to us all. Or our enemies, should they find it first. They won't. You've seen to that. I assume you know where this storehouse is? Ah, Mr. Harrison. Gentlemen. How fair are your calculations? I believe the site lies somewhere within this region. That's a lot of ground to cover. My apologies. Were that I could be more accurate. That's all right. It suffices for a start. And that is why we've called you here, Master Kenway. We'd like for you to travel to America, locate the storehouse, and take possession of its contents. I'm yours to command. Although a job of this magnitude will require more than just myself. Of course. Upon this paper are the names of five men sympathetic to our cause. Each is also uniquely suited to aid you in your endeavor. With them at your side, we'll want for nothing. Well, then I'd best be on my way. I knew our faith in you was not misplaced. We booked you passage to Boston. Your ship leaves at dawn. Go forth, Haytham, and bring honor to us all. Hey guys, it's the. No, I don't know why I'm doing the intro again. I'm back. I think I'll end it here. I mean, this is just a little short video. Um, short recondition. Probably make it up into two episodes. And this is. The ship. So when we get back on, we should be on the ship. And we should be. Completing more of the game. We should be arriving to Boston in the next episode. So, goodbye as you listen to this amazing song. Some fresh air might do me good. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Bye.